All right, everyone, we back at it, guys. We're back at it. Just got off work, and I uh, came down to this little spot here on my lunch break, caught two bass. You guys can see in the video. I probably started off as the intro, and then uh, work our way around. So I'm gonna be fishing for bass again, guys. May be fishing with the same thing I fishing with yesterday, the spinner. And what we're gonna do is just go and fish some neighborhood ponds. There's three of them. We're gonna go and fish some community ponds, I forgot I meant to say, and um, I hear Los Salinas. And uh, we're gonna see if we can get up some content, some more bass. So we're gonna walk the, the banks, fishing down the shoreline like I was doing yesterday on that one video. And then we're gonna just see if we can catch a few today. So let's get it started, guys. I'll see y'all down there by the pond. All right, guys, it's gonna be the first spot we're gonna to try today, guys. A little bitty, small. These are the floodgates right here from Lake Caroline. So these are the floodgates. So we're gonna try right in this area. I I can cast better. I wanna get a fish out of every pond if possible. If possible, guys. Or out of everywhere I walk. If possible. Got one, got one, yep. Yeah, baby, right by them rocks. Right where you supposed to be at. Bass number one. This is a, I like these bass, they, they pretty. He's the one got the red eyes, guys. They are pretty fish. I think uh, Kid Crappie told me what kind of fish this was, but maybe a rock bass. But look at it guys that is a pretty fish it got stripes at the bottom you guys see it got these blue blue stripes cut at the bottom and the top part look like a large mouth the bottom part look like a sand bass brown kind of brown reddish eyes little bitty mouth and he's healthy for this little pond for this little thing he's very 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 healthy guys so what do y'all think I think it's called a rock bass. Uh, let me see. All right, guys, there we go. What is this bass called? You see the red eyes? I think Kid Crappie told me it might be a rock bass, maybe. I'm not sure. Pretty little bass, though. Got stripes on it. It's kind of weird looking. Top part like a large amount of bottom part. Bottom part look like a sand bass. Let me get them back in the water. There we go. And it's kind of healthy. They normally are smaller in this, I think. I'm just going to toss them out because they rocks here. I'm older. I'm going to twist my ankle out here, so I'm just going to toss them out there. It's gone. So he shot off of that right in front of that rock. As soon as that blade was coming up, he came up and hit it. All right, guys, that's bass number one. Let's get back at it on the old spinner, guys. Trying to spit it, guys. 
with that spin, I got him. All right, fish number one. This kind of look like the fish I caught in that other little spot down there. It might, matter of fact, it is. Same type of fish in the first pond with the red eyes. Reddish brown as eyes. You can see those eyes there? Something got hold of a pretty little fish here. Hey, kid, uh, kid Crappie, if you see in this video, what's, what's the name of these fish again for me? And keep, keep slapping, man. I love your videos, man. I love your content. Big old bass. Well, good one. About a two and a half pounder. That blade getting it done, guy. There you go. Something got it good, boy. You been fighting. There you go, guys. Some nice bass. Right along that grass line. This is a this is another pond I'm fishing from a lunch break. Something got that fish good. You guys can see that bite more. Man. All right. up and hit that joke oh i don't know if y'all saw that on camera but he came up hit that one i love it i love to see him come up out of that out of the dark hit that spinner come down so you try to get me hooked there you go all right guys bass number two yep he uh was hanging around that grass and i saw when that spinner was coming up out the water he just came on up and grabbed it. Pretty little fish. There you go, guys. Getting it done. God, dog, that was a big one, guy. I tried to keep him down. That about a four pound. I tried to keep him down. Dang it. Got one. Just walk down. That dude jumping, boy. That rattle trap ain't no joke. He digging, but he ain't going nowhere. He digging, but he ain't going nowhere. You can stop. Oh, there we go. Oh, nice one. Nice one. About a three and a half pound. About three pound. Boy, this been a. I said rattle trap. I'm sorry. This bill is getting the job done, you guys. Man, you got you bass fishing might want to go to that spinner right now. God, what do y'all think? That's a pretty 
fish all spun out, skinny, but very pretty. Very pretty. Let's weigh it. You know, I got to weigh it, guys. I don't got into weighing these fish now to show y'all the weight. Loving this bag. Loving this bag, guys. There you go, guy. 2.6, 2.5. 2.5, guys. Just walked down, literally. And uh, let me cut that off. I want my battery to run off. All right, guys. So I literally just walked down and got a 2.5 bass, largemouth, guys. So what I'm doing, guys, so y'all see, early in the video, I was uh, fishing ponds, right? In my last video, I was fishing ponds. So I'm throwing down the grass line. So I hear, there you go, I'm going to get him back in the water. I'm so I, I hear um, what you would do is just like a pond, right? So you're looking for structure. It's a pretty fish. So you're looking for structure. So in the ponds. You're throwing down the grass line, right? The grass is where the fish going to be in. I hear them in the canal that I fish, they have this concrete, right? Guess where they're going to be? Same exact concept, right on the edge. because That's where they're going to hide. They're going to shoot out there and grab, the, grab whatever comes through. Over there, that, that, that shaded area, they'll love to be around that right there. And just go all up and down this concrete. And if you places like this, you'll catch bass all day long right now. I promise you guys. So let's get back at it. Too. Hope it don't spit it. This is a good one, guys. They strong in this little pond. There we go. These little children are strong. Get that spinner. All right, guys. The party continues. What about a two pounder? These fish are strong. There we go. On that spinner. She's full of eggs too. Now you know what I do, I put them on the other side so I can fish over here. Let's weigh it. Get it back in the water. Let's see what she weighs. One point fourteen, guys. One point fourteen. All right, guys. So, one point fourteen. Very healthy belly owner. Very pretty fish, guys. Um, and what I do is, uh, I actually put a few of them in here and um, just restocking. They might, they might go, if it rain, they might go right back down in there. I'm not sure if it's pouring down in there. But I put a few up here, so I can start fishing this side with bass. There you go. She's gone. All right, guys, y'all let me know if y'all liking the video. The party continues. That spinner is getting it done, folks. That spinner and that bait caster. I'm loving the fish with this bait caster, so we're going to see if we can catch two more before we end this video. All right, let's see if we can get right back out there, guys. Right back out there. There you go. There we go, got another one, guys. That's a good one right here. Well, they about the same. They just strong. Ooh, they are strong. It might be a little bit bigger. 
A little bit bigger than that one. This right here for two pounds for sure. Pretty, pretty fish. That spinner. Uh, what y'all think about that spinner, guy? One dollar at Walmart. One dollar lure doing all this, guy. A one dollar lure making all this. All this happened for me. All right, this might be a male right here. So let's see. Let's weigh it. I'm sure this is two pounds. This is bigger than the other one. All right, guys, 2.3. Two point three. Y'all can see that. All right, guys, we got a 2.3. Very healthy, very nice. I'm believing it's a male. So he can join the uh he can join that female I just put in. But very nice fish, guys. We're pulling them in on that spinner. Dollar lure from Walmart. And it's getting it done, guys. There we go. Very healthy. I'm bleeding on the tail, on the bed. Could be could be a female too. There you go. Well, this video, this bass video turned out to be something. Might be one of my best bass videos in a while, guys. So, I'm really enjoying, enjoying this, so. All right, guys, so that's the end of the show. So, guys, I had a great time bass fishing, guys. So, the bass are up in the grass, up close. And um, I think some are still spawning, honestly. Some bellies are big, some like they're spun out. But... Again, this is what I'm catching the fish with. An uh, angler. Angler. Bait caster. And rod combo. Six, six foot six. 12 pound big game. And a dollar spinner. One dollar from Walmart. This is the color. And this is the blade, guys. And this is what I caught all those uh, bass with. So guys, thanks again as always for liking the channel, uh, supporting the channel, watching my vids, uh, commenting, likes. If you share, share. If you pass my channel on to others, that's great. I appreciate every single one of you guys. It's Friday. It's Good Friday. Y'all have a blessed day. Stay blessed. Love your loved ones. And we're going to see if we can get some more fish this weekend. The winds are super high here in Dallas, so you can see my shirt blowing. So I've been wanting to put my boat or my kayak on the waters, but... It's just super, super windy, 16 miles per hour or higher. So I might do a lot of bank fishing, guys, but I'm ready to get back on crappie. So we'll see when I can get y'all guys a crappie video. I will start bringing some bluegill video as well and red ears. But y'all have a blessed day, man. Enjoy the weekend. Peace.